like to describe it as both a philosophy and a place. Um, the philosophy is that in order for children to be successful in school, they really need to have all of their needs met. And that includes their physical health, their social, emotional, and behavioral health. They need to have engaging things to do when they're out of school time. And their parents need to be really brought in as partners in their education and really be engaged with what's happening in school. We're working with over 150 different community organizations across the 10 schools that we're currently in. And we've seen the test scores rising in those 10 schools. And we've seen disciplinary incidents decrease dramatically. One example of how this works in practice was at Clinton Avenue School. When we sat down with their team and we looked at their data, what we saw was that their um, female students were disproportionately obese. When we really dug down into it, what we noticed was that there were no um, physical activity after school programs that were of interest to the older girls, the sixth and seventh grade girls. So when we sent out our request to the community, what we said was Clinton Avenue School is looking for after school activities, particularly ones involving physical activity that would be of interest to middle school age girls. And we were able to find a wonderful hip hop dance organization who could come in and provide dance instruction to their students. We've seen really great results with those girls that were participating in the class. Their school attendance has increased my children became um, very um, healthy, active, and they were focusing in, in their grades too. Now they have like more um, excitement to go because they got something to do. We've also realized that we really want to enhance our emotional behavioral health services here and social services for the kids because we have a lot of kids that need that extra support with all of the issues that they may be dealing with inside and outside of the school. Many of our kindergartners have been able to access their education a lot better because if they disrupt or they have some kind of dysregulation in class, they can then go out for a quick 10 to 15 minute session with their uh, boost therapist and then come back in um, and be able to pay attention in class. A lot of the kindergartners have shown a big turnaround, especially in their behavior, and that's allowed them to also show a turnaround in their academics. This past year, we visited the home of every incoming kindergarten student this year to talk to their parents about what parents can do at home to help their children succeed, and reading is a really key part of that. We want to start at a very young age, instilling a love of reading. And that's one of the reasons why we've helped Strong School to create a really nice place for young students to come, to take time out of their day, a very relaxing, fun atmosphere to enjoy books. I like coming down here because it is fun to read. We're starting to see a big cultural change in terms of the reading, just how much the children like to read, how much their parents are starting to read to them. But it's reading time. Five little mon monkeys jumping on the bed. The Boost philosophy at Clinton Avenue School means to us that we really want to provide a welcoming environment for all of our parents. We have to provide as many opportunities for parents to be able to come in to the school and participate in their child's education. We offer monthly events that celebrate student successes like Student of the Month and Most Improved Students. Tonight we're having our hip hop dance performance and our band's concert because as the students start getting older we start seeing less of their parents. To me, the thing that is most important about Boost is that it's really a culture shift. It's a new way of thinking about raising students' academic achievement. It's more than just providing more math, more literacy, more science education. It's about seeing the child as a whole child and as a community coming together to support those children to ensure their success.